next question, which is oh so important, is if Nathan Becker was a kitchen utensil, which what would he be? Spatula, because he whips people. <laughs> um, a fork. A spaghetti strainer. Okay, now the next question is why? Because he stabs you in the back. Because <laughs> it's a combination of many things. You can use it for anything. The next very important question of the hour is, if Nate Becker were a kitchen utensil, which would he be? Oh, it'd definitely, definitely be something annoying, like, uh, I don't know, a whisk. And your answer is because he's annoying, that's why he's a whisk? Yes. Okay. Yeah, why are whisks annoying? Because they, like, get the batter out of the bowl whenever you're using them. Probably a whisk. Whisk, whisk. <laughs> Sorry, don't know my kitchen utensils. Um, why? I don't know. He just he looks like a whisk, I guess. A ladle. A ladle. Okay, and why would he be a ladle? Yeah, I don't know. I just picked a utensil. A spoon. A spoon. Okay, why would he be a spoon? Because he has to gather a lot of things. I don't know. I think it would be a knife because he's always cutting up. If Nate Becker was a kitchen utensil, which would he be and why? You're a real cut up, Mr. Heron. What is the first thing that comes to your mind when I say Nate Becker? Chicken. <laughs> um, sarcastic and hyper. If Nate Becker were a kitchen utensil, what would he be and why? Oh my gosh, a spoon or something. Why? Um, kind of got a round head. Sound okay, Coke or Pepsi? Pepsi. Why? Uh, because no one likes Coke. Coke or Pepsi? You can answer that. I can answer that. Coke. Why Coke? It's always Coke. Just so you can be the opposite of No, it's always Coke. Okay. Well, we have a text and answer from an anonymous person to the answer of what would Nate be if he was a kitchen utensil. So we're going to show it to you guys. Here it is. A uh, spoon. Cool. Because okay. he's not the sharpest tool in the shed. <laughs> He'd be a KitchenAid mixer because they go really fast and have lots of energy. I want to ask him, Nate Becker, if you were a kitchen utensil, what would you be and why? I don't know. No, no. I'll, I'll think. Let me think about it. 